Hello, it's Philip Taylor speaking from Richmond Green Chambers, and I'm looking at a book that came in from uh, Witherby Publishing. It's this book here. It's a heavy book. It's got its own little carrier as well, which is quite nice pictures on the front. The book is a glossy. It's got photographs in it, nice colour photographs, glossy paper, so it really is a heavy book in 500 pages. There are all sorts of little annexes at the back there. There's a, a good index right at the back with a glossary, which I think is helpful there. The book itself is in sections, which is quite helpful. For instance, that shows you one of the sections there. And what you have got is a detailed preface. And the information contained in this is very, very um, keen in terms of the actual content. So ensuring cargo is a practical guide to the law and practice is something that many people will find of help in this specialist area of law. Let me say a few things with the review that we've put on the, the web and elsewhere. We've given the review a title, The Actual Practice of Marine Cargo Insurance Principles, because that's what this book is about. And what we say is this. If you're reading or watching this review, you are probably a shipping practitioner faced with complex claims which tend to hinge on detail and minute practicalities. Or perhaps you're an insurer, owner or claims adjuster confronted by complicated underwriting issues. If you're in any way professionally involved in marine cargo insurance, read this book because that's exactly what it covers. Um, I did this particular module for my bar exams, and in those days we didn't have this sort of thing, uh, which is a pity because it would have helped. I found the area very interesting, but also quite, quite complex, and as I said before, it's about minute detail. You could well find, of course, the answers to most, if not all, of your inquiries in this book. Um, as you'll discover, it's thoroughly researched by the author, and it's very readable. Um, the author is K.S. Uh, Vishwana. And he has produced, I think, a very uh, detailed piece of learning in this particular area. Um, in our view, although we're not experts in this field, it should be required reading, not just for legal practitioners, but also, as the author points out, for underwriters, brokers, forwarders, surveyors, P&I clubs, cargo owners and shippers. In other words, anyone involved in this particular area of activity. The subtitle, A Practical Guide to the Law and Practice, is certainly apt. As Vishwanath says, um, he's an underwriter and an adjuster himself, so he's got a lot of expertise. The emphasis is placed on what has happened, what can happen, and what actually does happen to marine cargoes, and the insurance implications and consequences which can flow and result from it. And let me give you one example. The consequences of an improperly drafted insurance policy on a cargo can be financially disastrous, whether for individuals or companies. The book, therefore, can certainly alert practitioners and all others concerned to the contingencies and risks that may impact on a particular cargo and on a particular voyage. And the specific aim here is, is obviously to construct insurance cover that is, no pun intended, watertight. Unlike most other books of its kind, which focus on the London market and on risks placed in that market, uh, Vishwana's book is global in its uh, scope, and I think that is an, another additional factor which makes it uh, of great interest internationally. And it covers other jurisdictions rather than just here, in London, France, Norway, and the US in particular. Let me conclude by saying that a particular note, there's an exhaustive and highly detailed chapter for on um, INCO terms and insurance interest um, that's included, of course, in this edition, uh, with a separate chapter also on seller's contingency insurance. And I think those are specific areas that people may be interested in, because none of the contemporary books available on insuring cargoes contain such a detailed um, commentary. So for practitioners and insurance professionals, not to mention students, insuring cargoes, in our view, is a welcome contribution to the literature of cargo insurance and the development of coverage and clauses in international markets, describing in 
what the author has put a very refreshingly topical way, the actual practice of the principles involved. So I'm very um, happy uh, to know of the existence of this book. So thank you to uh, Vish and also to uh, Witherbiz for publishing it. Bye-bye.